Another Monday night spent with that cigar and that golden whiskey. My night repeats like this as I sit here waiting for a good case to float my way. And tonight, I think my number's up. I just got that feeling, that chill in my spine. I guess I'll just have to keep waiting. Who's there? No. Ah. No. Ah, what are you? No. What's wrong? He's been a murder. Who's been killed? Me. Take a seat. Tell me what happened. It's not very clear, but I remember camping last night. By the old graveyard. There was this loud noise and this terrible smell. Oh, okay. Is there anything else? No, that's all I can remember. Okay, I'll take the case. I'll get down to the bottom of this for you. Is this a graveyard or is it a dump? It's no wonder you got ghosts walking around here. Look at this place. It makes me sick. So, what have we got here? One washing machine, one kitchen sink, one spider leg, complete with a trainer. One feather, large. Tire tracks wide and deep, and it looks like they left in a rush. And a weird footprint. <coughs> Who's there? Oh, oh, Mason. Who, me? Nothing. What? Just having a friend over for dinner. Sure, sure. Where were you last night between 10 and 11 p.m.? Uh, what's this, a shake-up? I just made parole this morning, honest. Hmm, prison again. So I guess this isn't your leg. Maybe it is, maybe it isn't. I got so many legs, it's hard to keep track of them all. You ain't lying to me, are you? I swear my mother's grave. I give it to you straight, Mason. I'm reinformed. Right. You wouldn't happen to know anyone that was here last night. Oh, sure, Mason. I'm always willing to cooperate with a man of the law. See that nest up there? <coughs> that Bresno. He's always there. He's your eagle. Thanks, MCNC. You stay out of trouble now. Of course, boss. Damn fly. You own this feather? Yet. Where were you between 10 and 11 p.m. last night? Nowhere. This is in connection with a crime. Are you telling me that you didn't see anything with those eagle eyes of yours? I see nothing. Oh, I see. Something stinks here. This needs further investigation. No match. Well, something else was driving through this graveyard, and it was carrying more than just a coffin. Excuse me, Detective Mason here. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah? This your card? Uh, yes, or yes, why? I found it near the scene of a crime that went down by the old graveyard last night. Oh, uh, a crime? That's terrible. Lucky for me, I was at home in bed at nine last night. Got an alibi. What? Uh, who? Do any work for eagles lately? Who? Uh, no. I don't know. What are you talking about? Got any other vehicles that you use? No, what? Of course not. Spill the beans. Excuse me, Detective Mason, but this is a place of business, and I don't appreciate this bullying. Kindly leave unless you have a warrant. Something stinks here, Weems, and I'm gonna get to the bottom of it. Okay, what have we left? This weird footprint and a whole bunch of rubbish. <laughs> the footprint, it almost looks like a dino- oh! Feels like I was hit by a truck. Where am I? Underground? A map on the wall. Graveyard, Weems, Reznov's nest. Paper, plastic? Someone's into the recycling. Ah!
Oh, I'm so sorry, sir. I presumed you were illegally dumping rubbish as well. I did not know you were an officer of the law and a private eye at that. Yeah, okay. Uh, do you mind getting me down from here, mister? Uh, what's your name? Ignatius Theodore Rex. Oh, okay. Rex, thanks. Oh, it's no problem at all, sir. It's lucky I ran into you, actually, as I was hoping for your assistance with something that's been... That looks like... Quick! Go, go! Follow that van! We are done for! I escaped back to the motherland! Reznov, you coward. You're in on this as much as I am. I doubt he will get too far. Yes. Funeral Director Weems, of course. I knew you stink to garbage. I was so close, I nearly got away with it. Jolly good job, Mason. Not like anyone else could have cleaned up this mess. Curse you, Mason. Quit the trash talk, Weems. Why'd you do it? Why'd you kill the girl? Not the girl. She was a liability. We couldn't have her talking about our operation. All that delicious rubbish money. And look at it now. All for the sake of a few euros. You okay, Mason? Sure. Take this trash away from me, Rex. <laughs> God damn. Detective! Sorry for startling you. Thank you for all your help. Not only for me, but all the other ghosts. We can now go back into our clean graves and rest in peace. I only wish we had something to repay you with. Uh, don't mention it. Sometimes the work is more important than the reward. Farewell, Mason Phelps. I only wish you could pay my rent with gratitude. Let's go back to my office. I have a proposition for you. <sighs> it's a bit chilly all of a sudden. Looks like we got a little bit of recycling to do. Thank you.